of the Tuan Invest 90S, which is um, currently located in the Mozambique Channel, not too far from Madagascar, with estimated winds of 30 miles per hour, pressure 1,007 millibars um, estimate from the JTWC. No watches or warnings were issued by uh, Mateo Madagascar, currently located 40.4 degrees south and 45.3 degrees east, and this could be a possible future cyclone in the Mozambique Channel if some models are to be believed. Um, the system is also most likely going to be a rain threat to um, Madagascar or at least parts of Madagascar based off of some models. Um, f this update is um, valid and being recorded at 14 o'clock UTC, that's 2, that's 2 p.m. and 17 o'clock AST, that's uh, 5 p.m. Um, and here's the expected forecast for Invest uh, 90S. Um, now, some most models are agreeing the system is going to continue moving to um, to the general southern direction in the Mozambique Channel um, and possibly move even more south, uh, further south than you see and, possible, and um, possibly stall in the Mozambique Channel and after that we don't really know where the cyclone is going to go. Um, there's uh, two different outcomes from the model runs. Uh, some models are saying it's going to um, go move south um, of Madagascar and possibly delivering heavy rainfall there and also um, mo some models are saying it will move near to Madagascar but the system will then move into Mozambique and possibly become a threat to Mozambique too um, making landfall possibly as a tropical storm or uh, category 1 equivalent remember this is uh, too early to tell so it may be different Invest 90S does not have any wind fields right now due to it not having winds of 40 miles per hour and none are provided by the JTWC. 109 miles away from Mayo, 343 miles away from Antananarivo, capital of Madagascar, 625 miles away from Toliara, which is in southern Madagascar, and 1,150 miles away from Maputo, which is in southern Mozambique as well. Um, so, looking at the sea surface temperatures for this system, you can see the sea surface temperatures are pretty warm for the system right now, so it's in very favorable conditions, it's only dealing with marginal wind shear, and um, where it's moving in the Mozambique channel, there's some wind shear, but keep in mind that wind shear is um, decreasing, and it'll probably be really, really low wind shear by the time it gets there, which is why some models are forecasting this thing to possibly become a um, cyclone well we are currently giving it a 40 to 50 percent chance because um, some other models are saying the system might not even form or most models are but um, we're giving it a moderate and um, because the conditions are really favorable for this system to form here's the wind shear like I said you can see the blue dotted lines is the wind shear decreasing so um, there's the wind shear is decreasing for where the storm is going to go and uh, stall out and where the storm is currently nearby right now so it's going to give it some time to um, organize and move out of its blob phase or I like to say um, this is not sea surface temperatures map this is um, my forecast or my personal forecast of the system's rainfall um, so you can see a low chance in some regions, moderate chance in some regions, and high chance of heavy rainfall in some regions. No, this is not an official, this is issued by me, and this is a, um, rain, a rainfall map um, of how the percentage of chance of heavy rainfall the uh, places of Madagascar will get up to 90 hours using multiple model runs. So, um, yeah. This is what the GFSR models are saying about this system when it comes to um, rainfall. You can see that um, the little yellowish things are heavier rainfall. So you can see we can see up to um, 300 to 350 um, milliliters of landfall. I mean of rain. That's what the GFS model is saying. So uh, coastal regions of Madagascar and the th southern region could face heavy rainfall and minor flooding. Here's what the European models are saying. Um, the European models are basically saying coastal areas of Madagascar are going to get landfall and um, as well as heavy uh, rainfall, but not as much as south as the GFS models were saying. So this is how Invest 90S currently looks like on satellite. So um, it's currently um, 
not that impressive right now but you can see have it some uh, convective activity and I believe the radar was showing it's still delivering some rain in um, Madagascar this is how it looks like on visible uh, nothing much to see here um, but as the system is exiting to the Mozambique channel it's having some convective activity and uh, could organize and there's also humidity there so that might as well help the uh, system uh, that is it for the update thank you guys for watching comment like and subscribe for more and we'll i'll see you guys for future update goodbye